relaxed look on today because we're going to relax at the Key West. Yes, we went to Disney Springs and took the boat over so we could end the night there. But we're going to go to the um, the movie that they have every night and it's Hercules tonight which is one of our favorites. My favorite. So. And we're going to show you later on the picture of Sarah when she's little with her family and yeah, Olivia's. Yeah, it's just busy right now because it's dinner time and we don't want to be like sticking our elbows and, and armpits in people's faces while they eat. <laughs> so we're just going to enjoy the Come resort on. until the movie. Come on! <laughs> Peter's taking books on the shelf and reading them. This book is from 1907. <laughs> Guys, I've been coming here. I don't even know how long. My first time I stayed here was probably like 13 years ago and I've never seen this. We just went into community hall and there was like all these crafts and like it literally transported you like 25 years like there was like just like paintings on the wall and like photos of like the old DVC stuff and it was so cool there's like a phone in this box like this was obviously the first DVC resort but some of the things really are still outdated but it's so funny like we just have never seen all of this stuff before because we're usually at the parks or like we swam in the quiet pool when we were here and it's just so funny. It's like I felt like this place was my home and it's like I'm finding all this new stuff out about it. Oh my goodness. There's a hammock. And bags. Old Key West bags. And this playground. Multiple hammocks. And a volleyball court. And a stage. Wait, and a family tree. What? Which one is it though? I think it's the whole thing. Wow. I wonder if they planted that in 1991. Yeah, look at it. It's all the same thing. It's all like sprouting from it. Holy smokes. This is such an educational visit. I tell you, I don't know what it is, but that woman over there says anything and I just have to do it. I don't know what it is. I must love her or something, but we're off to go get donuts because why not? We're at Old Key West about to watch a movie, so. Okay, sometimes, even when you live in Disney World, you got the vacation, vacation vibes and munches going on. And that's what we got here. We got Edmund's Donuts because that's like Sarah's staple. Like, it was an Old Key West Disney World vacation without Edmund's Chocolate Frosted Donuts. And she's been jonesing for a, uh, a monster, so. I'm gonna surprise her with one. And now it's time to go watch Hercules, which is like what me and Sarah used to watch before we were dating when we were like just smitten with each other. Look at this poolside setup. Gorgeous sky, gorgeous castle. Awesome movie. Edmund's Donuts. But what's the, what's the kicker, the surprise? Are you happy or what? This is like my staple when I stay in Old Key West. These donuts are my jam. And this movie is my jam. If you wait a little bit, maybe I'll quote some of them for you. So I can say the entire movie. Pain! Oh! And panic! Oh! Reporting for duty! Fine, fine, fine. Just let me know the instant the, the fates arrive. Oh! They're here! The fates are here and you didn't tell me! Memo to me. Memo to me. Name you after my meeting. Hercules, stop! You can't do this to me again! Did you enjoy the movie? So, we have to re do a rain check on our promise we made you about showing the picture of Sarah when she was a little kid. Because though it's, it's slower in there, there's a family sitting right at that table. And it's right where the photo is. So we don't want to intrude on their dinner. I tell you, you guys may get sick of it, 
but I will never, ever, 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 as long as I breathe, and even afterwards when I haunt this place, we'll stop advocating on just little strolls and evenings and mornings through Disney Springs. Look at that. Look at those beams of light. We finally figured out. Look at this out. beaming, beam, beam of light. We talked about those lights in so many other vlogs, like being at Hollywood Studios and being like, what is that? And Peter calling them aliens. Finally figured it out. It's Planet Hollywood. It smells so good right here. It really is. I'm full and I'm hungry again. I know. Now I have to walk around with these. Oh. Hey. You love them things, though. So the rumor on the street is that they've got some nifty little things, some new things at Disney Springs, or at uh, World of Disney, and we're gonna go check them out. Fall and Halloween decorations and merchandise. Look at look at this giant tree of Jack. Jack mug. Jack, Jack, Jack. Halloween, Halloween, Halloween. I think you need a pair of Halloween ears. I don't think you have any. I think we need to get you some. Look at that bag. Look at that bag. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. Mickey. Minnie. Goofy. Pluto. Super cute. 1999 each. I can't believe it's out. Oh my god. So we were literally just talking about how how nice it is. Even more. Hold on. Salt and pepper set? Pepper or salt? Pepper? Ooh, we need those to go through. Look at those those pumpkins up there. Halloween 2017. Okay, I keep getting distracted. We were just talking about how nice it is that Disney celebrates the holidays so early. And some people think it's ridiculous because the first Halloween party is in like six days from now. We don't have tickets yet. Oh, this is heavy. You could cook, cook up some, some potions in that. But with it, Disney celebrating the holidays for so long, it's nice because it's almost like the best of both worlds for us. You get to experience Halloween so early and then the Christmas so early. But yet when we go home to Chicago to see friends and family, it's not like we're missing Christmas here, even though we're going to be in Chicago because we get to celebrate it while we're here. Right? She's about to I'm first. malfunctioning. <laughs> oh, and when we say boom, you are going to dance like there's no tomorrow. I love these two guys. I'm so happy they're on the big stage. Sarah's got a belly ache because we had donuts for dinner, basically. What? I said your belly hurts because you had donuts for dinner. But we're at Disney Springs, so you you got to get yourself a fridge or your deli. Just, there's no other way to live. There's no other way to live. But right now, as we finish out this night, we are going to dance, and that's going to start right now. Everybody move, move. Everybody move, move. Everybody move, move. Everybody move. Now free. Right now, you know it's funny looking. This dance move here is called Hit the Wonder Woman. <laughs> yes, that's right. Now, what do you have to call it? This is called, uh, maybe I was going to pay it, but I forgot my wallet. Yeah. Now, this here is all over. This move is called, Guys, I'm having trouble starting my lawnmower. <laughs> yes, that's right. And I can flow with the words. This is called, Woo! My deodorant work. <laughs> yeah, that's no way about to see this dude perform. <laughs> yes, that's right. And ever since you were born. Yes. Ever since you were born, you know, never choose to mourn. <laughs> yes, and he He's about to do the unicorn move. Move. Everybody move. Move. Everybody move. Move. Everybody move. Thank you. I just have one thing to say. What? I just have one thing to say about that. that? Can you please do the unicorn? No. Come on. No, it's not do the do the unicorn part though. What? Do the unicorn part. Sarah hates being put on the spot. No matter, no matter who, who she, who, no matter who puts her on the spot, even her own husband. Look at her run. Come back here. Sit. Good girl. Good girl. Take it, go. <laughs> she wouldn't take it. She was just like licking it. Um, but we're home. We had a nice, nice cooling and. And nice little relaxing night. <laughs> cooling. Cooling. It was kind of cooler. I think. Yeah, I think it was we're, nice. We're slowly acclimating to this new this new climate because it was like 80 degrees 
It felt with good. A little bit, with a little breeze. It rained like, usually it rains around two or three and it like just gets hot and sticky and humid afterwards. But it rained later, like five or six-ish, and it was like the sun wasn't beating down to heat everything back up and make everything humid. So it was kind of cooler. Yeah. So it was nice. It was a good, good night. What else happened today that I wanted to tell everybody? We got a P.O. box. Oh, yeah. And it's exciting, like, not because, like, oh, send us stuff. But it was like a double, it was like a double one because we had our old address in Chicago on our Plain Crazy Button website, which was fine, but, like, people, a few, we did get a few letters, and it was like, it, they were very nice, but it was like, it didn't hit me at first. I was like, how did these people who watch our YouTube find our address? I'm like, oh, wait, these people, like, also saw the Plain Crazy Button Club, and our address is our business address then. So it was just, like, a smart and safe and and convenient way for um, any of any of you guys watching again touch with us or anybody who orders plain crazy or has to do returns or exchanges or anything of or that is sort. Or anything forwarded if when we send something out then at least it comes It'll back, come to, back us. to us. So it's now just we have now a PO box that's that's near my work and it's convenient for us to stop it to send our, our buttons and to receive anything that we do. So you'll yeah. see that in our info and down below. Alrighty, it's good to be home, right? It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.